Hey everybody. So we're going to get into this. Okay. This is just, I know, I know, I know Diamond Art Club is moving. I know they've moved their warehouse. I, I get it. But this is so weird. I saw people, we all ordered on the same day. It was only up for one day, right? Thursday. That was it. And people had it by the weekend. They were working on it on Friday or Saturday. They had it. Um, Becky, she got hers on, gee, when did she get hers? Monday. She got hers on Monday. I live in the same state. I got mine on Tuesday. Mine came to my local post office, which I don't get. Becky said hers came to UPS. Mine went to my post office, and then my U.S. mail delivered it. Who knows? I don't get it. And then mine says it came from West Hollywood, California. Hmm. West Hollywood, California. The last I knew, they weren't even in California. I don't know. Anyhow, let's hope that they uh, get this shipping stuff straightened out as quick as possible, because it's all weird. Anyhow, this is bigger than I thought it was going to be. Or maybe the box is just bigger, but it's huge. The box is huge. But there it is, the limited edition Halloween nighttime round with ABs. I think the AB is actually the special gem that glows in the dark, from what I can tell. This was a special edition glow in the dark from Diamond Art Club. So here's your nine steps on the back of the box, how to diamond paint. This one comes with the... Uh, the snowflakes. I've been getting a couple snowflakes lately putting the things I've been ordering. So let's get into it. I know that I saw somebody get a sticker. Somebody didn't get a sticker. I don't know. Uh, like I said, it's just kind of all over the board. Who knows? Who knows? So the concept of the glow-in-the-dark diamonds intrigued me immensely. And I wanted to do something with the glow-in-the-dark diamonds. I did not care for the chakra lotus. I just, that's not my thing. I didn't want to do that one. So, there, see there's a sticker. I got a sticker, I got a toolkit. And this is, what did I say? 47 by 47, so it's almost 50 by 50. It's bigger than I thought. I thought it was smaller than that. And a ton of black, oh man. But there it is, 16 colors, and number one, I don't know, maybe there's, no, number one? No, that's just 300. I think this is the special one down here, E742, which is A. I think that's the glow in the dark. I think, I don't know. We'll find out in a second. But like I said, I didn't really care for the chakra lotus. That's not my style. But this, I could get, I could get behind this. I can support this one, yeah. I'm not a huge um, Halloween fan, so Halloween pictures don't really do it for me. But this isn't like really Halloween. This is more just fall and pumpkins. There is a little spooky house, but it's not really spooky. This just reminds me of a fall evening with your pumpkins on your porch. That's what it reminds me of. So in the toolkit, two heart waxes. Where's my, fa where's my hand? I can't even find my camera. Two heart waxes, the drill pin. Um, a clear tray with some baggies, a three-placer, and a squishy in there. So there is our toolkit. All right, let's open up the canvas. I don't know why. For some reason, I thought it was smaller than this. But it's actually a you know, pretty good size. It's almost a 50 by 50. So here we go. Here we go, the nice soft canvas and all their information at the bottom. How to contact them. Um, a coupon, if you hadn't used that one, for bigger is better. You could only do that once, I believe. But there you go, look at all that black. Oh, that is black. Ugh. I am not one for big blocks of color, but this has big, huge blocks of color. So I'm going to have to deal with that, aren't I? There's the little jack-o'-lanterns popping out. They're pretty cute. I like jack-o'-lanterns. And then we have the tree and the moon. Somebody talked about bats. I love bats. Okay, bats are good, you guys. Somebody was saying they think that the bats were good because they eat mice. Well, bats are really good because they eat mosquitoes. Bats love mosquitoes. So here's a little fact I'll tell you about bats. Um... 
people freak out because they get bats like fly at them and follow them and they're creepy and they're going to eat them and they're, you know, going to get in their hair and all kinds of weird stuff. Well, bats only do that, like we go out and we walk a lot and we live in the country, so we see bats and they do look like they're kind of following you down the road and swooping at you, but you know why? They're after the bugs because as we humans are walking, we attract the bugs. Our scent attracts the mosquitoes and the flies. And so the bats will come towards people because the bugs are there. Yeah, they're smart. They eat tons and tons of bugs. So that's a little fact about bats. I love bats. There it is. It is cool. It's just super cool. That's going to be so neat. Wow. I have to finish my uh, drills and chills fall picture. The trees, the Diamond Art Club autumn trees. I have to finish that before I can do this. But I do want to do this before Halloween is over. Not that it has to be Halloween, but I guess the jack-o'-lanterns. I don't know. I could do this up until November, and it would still count, because who doesn't have jack-o'-lanterns or pumpkins sitting around in November? I know people do. I know people do. Like I said, 16 colors, and I think that last one is the, what they're calling AB, which I think is the glow in the dark. So, let's get into it. I will get them out, and I will show you what we got. Pretty exciting. Alright, so we know we have black. Yes, we have some black. Like one, two, three, four, five bags of black. And then we have our selection of oranges and things that look like black, but I think it's brown. And an orange. And 742 is an orange. And this is kind of like a maroony brown color. Orange, brown, 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 yellow, and E742 is this orange. This is the one I'm pretty sure is the glow in the dark because it's got that special E742. That's going to be glow in the dark. So the color is probably similar to DMC code 742, or maybe it's the exact same color, but this one's going to glow in the dark. I don't know how they make that happen. I don't know how they do that. A burnt orange. Ooh, this is bright yellow right here. They almost look like they could be a little sticky in there. Maybe it's just the way the package was folded. I don't know. It's 444. Ooh. Little tiny bit of this tan and a little bit of this light yellow. And I have that way high. Sorry, guys. But there you go. So I think, I'm pretty sure these are the glow in the dark. We'll have to see. Maybe I'll leave them sit out for a while. And then turn off the lights tonight and see if the package glows before I even start the kit. What do you think? Mm -hmm. That'd be kind of cool. Let's see if this package glows. Anyhow, there they are. There's the colors, all of them. It's, wow, that is some heavy bags of 310. And did I mention I really hate multi-placing? I really hate multi-placing. I hate big blocks of color. Did I mention that? What was I thinking? I wanted to go on the back diamonds. That's what I was thinking. So I got them. I guess I'm going to have to multi-place and I'm going to have to deal with some big box color. Oh. Anyhow, did I show you the symbols? I didn't. I didn't show you the symbols. Oh my goodness. All right, let's look at symbols. Let's look at something interesting besides three tenths. Let's look at this part. There we go. There's what I like to do. No more than like three or four <laughs> in a row. That's my style there. Yeah, I really like confetti. I don't mind confetti one tiny bit. Look at this looks like Michigan over here. Do you see this? Look at there's Michigan. There's the thumb. You can pee up here. Okay, maybe not, but sorta. Anyhow, there it is. It will be pretty. I can't wait to see it glow in the dark. And of course, you know it's sticky. We really don't need to test the stickiness because we know it's sticky. But it's perfect. There you go. It's in perfect shape. Looks beautiful. So let me finish up my drills and chills, finish up those trees. I have one small section to go, and then I can start this, which is not what I was going to start. 
I was going to start my MSU helmet el emblem type thing, but <sighs> see how things go. See? See what happens? All right. So I got a sticker. Yay. Sticker. Toolkit. Diamonds. Yay. It's finally here. I can get started. So thanks for watching, guys. And uh, if you were lucky enough to get one of these limited editions, no telling how many of them they had, congratulations. And um, I wonder where yours came from. New Jersey, Las Vegas, California, the Bahamas. I don't know. Hope you got it. <laughs> Anyhow, Diamond Art Club, I'm sure that this will all be ironed out very soon. So, anyhow, there you have it, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Oh, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. It really does help when you hit the like button. I don't know. It does something with YouTube. It tells them things about us as creators. I don't know what it does, but hit the like button if you liked it. Subscribe, of course, if you liked it. I'll see you guys.